Hey everyone, this has nothing to do with my rest of my page or anything, but this is a, I fixed a problem that has been frustrating me and probably millions of people for like two years related to Facebook. So like a year and a half, two years ago, Facebook told me, oh, you should sign up for this two-factor authorization thing using Google's Authenticator app. Okay, sure. So I did that. Uh, then I got a new phone. But what I didn't know was that you, when you transfer phones, you couldn't just put it next to your phone and transfer all the data like you always do with all your apps when you get a new phone. For the Google Authenticator app, you had to take the QR code on the fo old phone, take a picture of your new phone, and transfer it that way. I didn't know that. And I, well, and I got rid of my old phone, let it trade in. So I no longer had the app to get into Facebook. And I slowly got signed out of my various phones and iPads and desktop computers until all I was down with was my one phone that was signed in for the past year and a half. And I used this uh, phone for business, on Facebook for business. So it was really frustrating. And I tried everything. I've spent hours and hours reading message boards, watching YouTube videos, and all the YouTube videos are most of them are scams from other countries saying they can do it. And then you read all the comments and they're like, oh, contact me and I'll help you. They're all scams. And there were a couple that probably worked for people. There was one where a guy was like, people saying buy uh, MetaQuest and they'll help you because they actually have uh, customer support. Well, I did that. I spent, I bought a $700 MetaQuest thing, Quest 3. Um, they had support. They would not help me with my uh, Google Authenticator or, or password or anything. Then uh, other people said, well, take, uh, say you're threatening them, send these threatening these emails. Anyway, there's all these different things. None of them work. None of them. And I had no uh, access to my account except for on my phone. And then Facebook changed something, okay? I'm not gonna be able to show you and screen record all that because I've already done it. Uh, but I'm gonna show you, I'm gonna hold this up. This is old school, I'm an old man. Uh, it, but it helped me and I spent, maybe this will help someone out there. Uh, so when you go to sign in and you, don't, you go to do your password and ask for that code, I don't have the code. Uh, but look, this time, hold on, I'm gonna do it right here. You know, hold on one second here, I'm gonna log in. And it, so it looks something like this, right? So it says, ask for your, uh, you know, ask for your sixth code. You say, I didn't receive a code. <gasps> and this time, because I was able to change it, it asked, I, I've changed it right. So now it's asking me for a text login. But this is what popped up that was new. Chat with us, contact us from the help center. And you click on this and down here, it says chat with us, okay? And with that chat with us, what it said was, send us uh, a code. And I was like, what, where do I get the code? I don't have the code. And then they said, oh, but, this, but if you read further, there's a button on the bottom that says send a video. So I was like, all right, I don't have the code, but I'll send a video. Once you click send a video, they will then e email you this code. And you have to record a video of your own face. You have to write, excuse me, you have to write down the code on a piece of paper, or your hand it says, or a piece of paper, and you have to take a video of your own face. Sorry, I have a cold. And you want to move your head around and move your hand back and forth and then send them the video in. I was like, this sounds crazy, but sure. So I did it. And it's a little creepy that, you know, AI and, uh, you know, face recognition got me back in. But within two hours, they emailed me back, probably computer, and it has given me five access codes. Okay. They're one time use for three days. And I was able to sign on my desktop. I was able to sign on my iPad. And from my desktop, um, I was able to go into uh, the privacy settings and I had to turn on, well, for now, I turned on the text message one. So they'll text me a code if I need it. But I was also able to turn off the Google authentication uh, app. I've been trying this for two years. I've spent, so, it's so frustrating. You know what I feel like? I feel like, I don't know, I, this way I feel like an Aladdin when uh, the genie gets his chains off at the end and he's free. That's what I feel like is, I hate this Facebook. Um, anyway, I know it's a crappy video. I know I should have been screencast this, but if you watch this, maybe it'll help someone. I'm gonna post this on YouTube. Um, and good luck to you. Hopefully they don't change it again or tell you some random help page that doesn't work again. Uh, but this worked after freaking two years of trying everything and spending I don't know how many hours searching the internet and trying different methods. So hope that works. Good luck, guys.